my channel by knowing your budgets or if you're new hello welcome i am so glad to have you here today we do all things cash stuffing budget planning saving challenges and honestly just all things dealing with money and of course we come here to chat so you guys for today's video we'll be stuffing our savings challenges so i'm so excited about it um y'all already know these are my favorite ones to do all right so let's go ahead and see how much money we're going to be stuffing today so we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So we have $124 today that we're going to stuff, which is a really good amount. Let's go ahead and get the money on the cash tray. And let's go ahead and get right into the cash stuffing. All right, besties. So if you missed Wednesday's video, definitely go check it out. I'm going to have it up here in the iCards so that you can click it and go watch it after this video. Um, so Wednesdays, between Wednesdays and today's video, we're going to be stuffing a total of $262 like we always do. So let's go ahead on to our abundance fund. So, by the way, I will be having a $2 and $10 Tuesday. So this Tuesday, I'm going to have a couple different things in the shop. Um, discounted to two dollars and ten dollars so these envelopes will be um, available and they will be ten dollars so you can get five of these envelopes for ten dollars which is a really good deal so definitely go grab you a couple sets um, we also have the transparent as well I just you know like to do little sales here and there because I know that it would be nice you know to have a little sale um, here and there to get something at an affordable price so definitely go check it out so we're going to go ahead and start with the abundance fund and this is the 26 week savings challenge it saves 1250 we have three different versions of it this is the lowest one that I decided to do because I am low income and that's just what works for my budget so we're going to go ahead on and add in $50 while I let it dry and then I will give y'all a close so 20 40 and 50 I really wanted to do a challenge that was just six uh that was just 26 weeks so that it would be half of the year and the rest of the other half of the year I could do something different while still saving my thousand dollars for my abundance fund so we have one thousand one two three four hundred twenty forty sixty eighty five hundred twenty thirty forty fifty so 550, 51, 52, 53, 54. So 1,554, I think is what we have. So that is a really, really good amount to have. I'm so, so excited about that. Um, so at this point, I really could go ahead on and mark off like the rest of this one. So pretty much what it is, is the money that I'm saving on this one is really counted for this challenge so that I can go ahead and say I completed it, which I already completed the save 1k with the bestie um, because I just went on ahead and put the thousand dollars towards it, but I still had 500 more dollars to go. And so the money that I put towards this is really going for that. But when I get done, it's going to be over $2,000. So, nonetheless, I just wanted to finish the tracker, so I'm so excited about it, but I'm tracking on the other one, so. Alright, Black Friday is not going to get anything, besties. <laughs> so, we have 20, 40, 41, 42, 43. So, we have $43 there. Um, I was also thinking, like, once I get a good amount and month ahead... I will probably also put the money into the abundance fund as well. So it'll it'll work out in the end when y'all see what I'm talking about. So this is the Black Friday Shopping Savings Challenge. I absolutely love it. It saves $1,000. We all need that shopping spree at least once a year. So Black Friday is my time. Don't get me wrong. I pretty much do shop all year. I'm not going to lie. I shop all year. Um... At least once a month, I try to get myself something that is not like for the house or something like that. I try to get, you know, just myself something or do some kind of self-care. So, but Black Friday, I absolutely love Black Friday because, you know, 
I get to shop the deals as well for myself and I don't feel bad about it you know having buyer's remorse or whatever because I save the money to shop so that's what I do so 2030 35 and 36 and I know some people say that the best deals are like way before Black Friday so I'm definitely going to keep my eye out because I might be able to get some Christmas gifts at a really good deal I know I also saw this post I think it was on TikTok and they were like where does everyone buy their underwear from like <laughs> I know you're probably like what but yes yeah, like I've been thinking about that as well I did used to get underwear from Victoria's Secret pink but I don't know does anybody still buy underwear from that for some reason when I go there I can never really find anything that I really like and the prices have really gone up like you could literally used to get seven pairs of underwear for $27 I think it's sometimes 25 and now it's like 32 35 or 34 they used to also have a deal where it would be like 10 for 27 like it used to be cheap but everything is going up which I understand but I'm like does anybody still buy underwear from there I know people in the comments were like shopping at Victoria's Secret Swiss what is tacky I still like the underwear it's nothing wrong with it but I do like to keep up with the trends so let me know or don't it's up to y'all but Y'all know I like to chat, so I was like, I really want to know, like, where does everyone get their underwear from? <laughs> like, seriously, so 120, 40, 60, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, so 230, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, so 252, I think it's 252 in Christmas. But yes, plus we all love a good deal because I had saw where someone was like they could get a pack of 20, 10 or 20 underwears for like a really good amount on Amazon. And I'm like, I'm definitely going to check out Amazon. So we all love a good deal. So besties, definitely help us out. Help us out. Okay. All right. So security is going to get $25. Y'all, we have been doing this one consistently. I'm proud of myself. I really am. Like, I'm we have to celebrate the small wins right so let's see 25 at least we'll have something in this envelope <laughs> come time for the um the bill all right my fiance just called me <laughs> so let's go ahead and try to get this a little bit air dried okay yeah so that's a little bit dry so let's go ahead and add in 25 dollars 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, and 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So, 111 dollars. It's really good. Something is better than nothing. But, yes, besties, I just absolutely love to shop. Oh, y'all, let me tell y'all. So, I had applied for this um, thing where I could get, you know, it's like a, it's not like, a scholarship or anything but it's like a grant but not a grant type of thing I don't know how to explain it but I apply for something for my job and I actually got accepted and I got my first payment and the payment was $17.50 I think it is and so I'm really going back and forth y'all I'm like the initial <laughs> plan was to pay down some of my student loan debt and so now I'm like, do I have the right amount here, y'all? I think I did something wrong. Okay, besties, I'm not sure what I was talking about, but <laughs> I don't think we have enough for what I'm supposed to be doing for the monthly challenge. I'm missing a five. I guess I didn't budget for it. So we have 10, 11, 12, 13 I need my five dollar bill okay so I'm about to pull five from gas because um this is where I have a five dollar bill and the savings challenge is way more important so I'm not sure maybe I over budgeted five dollars so anyhow 
All right, let's go ahead and add this five. I cannot remember what I was talking about for the life of me, but um, let's see. Let's get the money out of here and let's check this off. So it's supposed to be $90. Um, so let's hope that's what it is. I'm gonna have to exchange some of these bills. So 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. Yay! So 90 dollars. Y'all that threw me for a loop because I'm like, what? Wait a minute. And I have no idea what I was talking about. So there's that. Sorry. I'm not sure what I was getting into. Okay, so we have 90 here. Definitely go pick up this monthly challenge, besties. I have a lot of besties picking this challenge up. <laughs> and I'm trying my best to get all orders out. I'm like literally like going at a pace that has been like peaceful. Because I remember when I was like so stressed because I was getting like so many orders in at once. But I finally know how to like pace myself and get out you know a few orders a day so i'm so thankful and grateful for you all definitely go pick up this savings challenge y'all i absolutely love it it is so doable so easy and you save 13.50 who doesn't need 13.50 okay um but yes um and anyways it might be a small amount to you but a small a win is a win whether it's small or big so it doesn't matter if you're doing small savings challenges like i do or big ones celebrate be thankful and grateful that you get to save a little bit of money that you have shopping money christmas money you know birthday money self-care money gas groceries just be thankful and grateful but you guys um that's pretty much it for today's video don't forget to like comment subscribe to your friends about my channel so i'm coming over here buddy with us chat with us a little bit go check out my website magnoliabudgets.com especially on tuesday we're having a two in ten dollar tuesday so a couple things in the shop is going to be discounted you don't want to miss it um go check out my etsy shop as well it's linked down below in the description box i'm sure there's something over there that you will love and i will catch you guys in my next video all right bye